Akuma MC launched a brand new epic season of Minecraft Prisons. Number one, which I want to showcase a little bit, is the AFK Miner. I'm actually going to start off by checking that out because that sounds freaking awesome. Hold on, it's lagging, it's lagging, it's lagging, it's lagging, it's lagging. I can't check out the AFK Miner right now because for some reason, I went over there and my entire game said, no. Basically, to sum it up, there's an AFK area, you go there, and there's some upgrades. There's seven upgrades, efficiency, wealth, investor, XP hunter, key finder, treasure hunter, fuel finder. And then there's three types of fuels you can give them, and a bunch of other stuff. I'm gonna be checking that out later down the line, especially when it's fixed. There's a PvP rework, which I'm not gonna go too much into detail about, because I'm not that big into PvP. But you can also check out all the information for yourself, akumamc.net, or it should be down in the description below. There's ascension quality of life changes, I haven't even hit ascension, so... Yeah, mortar changes, and this is a huge W. They added Guardian Beam, Meteorite, Geyser, and Wild Wither to be activated through the ammo quality and lowered the required blocks from 150k to 100k. Enchant quality of life, I'm not going to go into all of this, but you can check it out for yourself as well. They made a bunch of changes to some enchants, nerfing, buffing them, and such like uh, stuff like that. All token enchant prices are dropped by 5%. They also made Nuke a level 50, it looks like. Or no, sorry, added 50 nuke as a starter enchant it is a very early enchant again which means our rank ups are going to be absolutely killer this season payout adjustments gang quality of life changes and other quality of life changes but for the most part it's a lot of balancing and changing and all that which i am super excited for i already did my main things of slash reclaim which you guys should always do when you first start on the server if you have any uh ranks or anything of course claim your op kits your normal kits if you want them your v kits if you have it kit legendary because that gives you some good stuff too and of course like i said v kits which i want to go ahead and grab all of these up six pets let's see what i get Okay, um, I'm gonna go ahead and actually just salvage immediately if there's anything I don't want. Honestly, you know what? Because I don't know what my plan is for the pets this season, I'm gonna go ahead and store them all up. And I'll figure it out after. Three bronze, four silver, and two gold mystery vaults. What do I get from those? Rune points are always pretty good, especially early on. Let me put down all of these and see what I get. Skin boxes early on. That's... That's huge, but I don't think I'm going to get any skins unlocked. All right, well, these I got to go to spawn for, which sucks a little bit, but that's also okay because I can just spam them down, get them out of the way, probably just absolutely fill my inventory. So I'm going to pull up slash salvage just in case. So I want to obviously keep at least enough for a full set of everything. I already have better pants, don't I? So the pants can go, the chest plate can go. Can I get a skin like day one that would be insane dude all right well we still have some things to open but before i get into these actually what kind of keys we got five vote keys uh we got a few of these Ooh, wow that's that's a lot i should actually just set rpgs to auto salvage already Ooh, okay we did get lumberjack but we also got mind splitter lumberjack gives tokens mind splitter gives gems let's stick with lumberjack for now and for our first v kid crate of the season what do I get? Okay, we got some nice openables, which I'll save for the next one. I don't want to open them now. A vegan crate out of it. Okay. I don't want those, though. I mean, I should probably just wait. I'll probably get more. Ooh, four robot generators to start off is absolutely massive. We also got a custom tag, a god rank, and some openables, which are always great. I'm just going to start saving the openables for later. Even the ones that I can open here. A $20 store coupon. That is insane. And actually, you know what I can do? We got one epic token robot, two common uh, gem, and one epic gem robot. Nice. I've got 159 trillion. How do I want to spend that? Obviously, I want to max out token finder. That's just a given. I want to max out bolt. There's no reason not to. Nuke's already got 50 levels into it. I can max that up, but I'm going to leave it at that for now. Um, I could get a lot of levels of fortune, a lot of levels of token. Ooh, or key. F I think key finder. Water balloon finder. Oh. Oh, so it's like that other thing. Okay, so that's actually something I might want to have. I might want to get maxed out very early. But the thing is, I need 55 million gems. That's going to take a while, especially because I'm going to want to get lottery and I'm going to get going to want to get multiplier finder so I can get more gems. But that's down the line. It is officially time to start mining. Now, at least this pet gets some kind of use, but some of my pets just don't really get any use, which sucks. I already want to check challenges because it's actually very easy to do this. All I have to do is slash help tutorial and then that's it and then i can do slash challenge and i can go ahead and get my first challenge done it's super easy it's literally for free guys just do the commands you get a free 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 level and then you get nice things like this really awful booster 
These used to be so good. When grenades first came out, they were like a little rarer and they were just my favorite thing of all time. And you know what else? I totally forgot I had that $20 coupon that I just got. Let me hide my screen real fast and redeem that. Oh, you know what I just realized? I actually had another gift code I could have used, maybe. I don't know if it still works. I had a $5 code that I never used. I could have gotten the big one. Oh, that kind of sucks, but whatever. Oh, hey, our, our crate got here. Haha. <laughs> okay, I will go ahead and I want to spend 71 levels worth of uh, tokens into nuke. We've got it almost halfway, which is insane. Let me go ahead and open up this beautiful start of the world crate. Three, two, one. Bam! What do I get from this? Okay, we got some openables and a... <laughs> and it looks like my thing came here. Um, which is super awesome. I've got a awesome, very, very beautiful token booster there that I will save for uh, the future. Let's start off with the VK crate and see what I get. Chat color bundle. Wow. Oh, boy. That's fantastic. You know what? I actually am going to open the things that I can open here instead. Because I want more tokens. And these are going to give me more tokens. But I'm not going to spawn to open anything because I already messed up my momentum once. Now our last thing, our uh, last official start of the world crate. Unless I get another $20 uh, store coupon or a free start of the world crate from it. And I got robot generators. I'll take it. Two common, one legendary, one rare, three epic. We got... Three legendary gem and two rare gem. That is actually really good. A solid start. Robots are going to be massive for the start of this season. As you can see, they've made me, I mean, not much, but as I upgrade them, they're going to make me more and more. Yeah, so I don't know what my main goal is for, for this one. Um, It's going to be really hard for me to make progress, I feel like. Seeing as I can't really jackhammer my mind, I'm... This is all I can do, really. You know what? Let me try something. I have a few of these, don't I? Not those ones, but the small airstrikes. Let me do a little mine reset, and I'm gonna throw one, like, square in the middle. And I'm gonna see roughly how it does. Is it gonna be good for rank-ups, please? Oh, it sure is. Okay, but actually, I need to get it a little bigger first. That's the only thing. Oh, I just realized nuke activated. That's huge. But yeah, I'm, I can't utilize these to, the, to their full extent quite yet, because it does reset the mine before these end, which just basically gets rid of its its activation. I should probably go ahead and get some fortune, huh? You know what? Let's get some levels of fortune. That's going to help us get gems, which is going to be fantastic. And I know fortune's actually very good for that. Like, insanely good for that. If I could actually get my first 100 ranks, that would be a pretty sick start. But I honestly don't know if I can. That seems like it might be difficult. I don't think any of these are going to be a level. Oh, sorry. I was mistaken. I immediately got a lumberjack level. That's actually really huge. I don't know if I'm going to be able to reach rank, you know, 100. I, I might have to change my plan if I want to do that. Oh, I almost have 100k. Yup. Wow, I'm already halfway done with Multiplier Finder. That is actually crazy. Okay, guys, so I'm level 48. I literally need two more levels, and then I unlock Lucky, right? E oh, no, sorry, I unlock Vein Miner next. Ooh, okay. Maybe I wait on that then. Oh, I'm almost to 50, guys. Let's go! Big XLO! 50! And rank 47. Nice. Um, when do I, what's, what's the next enchant at? I already have it unlocked. You know what? I'm gonna put one level into Black Hole. A singular level, and then 13 more levels into Token Merchant. I'm actually gonna get 53 levels into Vein Miner, just so I have some levels into it, and so that it's possible of activating. Ooh, hello. Comet skin box. Oh, well, eh, you know, something, I guess. Now, I don't know where I go from here, though. It's just kind of slow progress, just slowly getting tokens, trying to get some enchants up. Or, I could go ahead and take those drills and try to get this last roughly 5,000 that I need or so uh, for this challenge, which I think I want to do. I want to get as many challenges done as I can day one. To be honest, if I get as many drills as I did last season, I really don't care. Four lines? This is giving me a lot of rank progress. I should have done this from the start. It's kind of a double-edged sword, though, because I'm not utilizing the drills to their to the best of their abilities. However, I am getting more rank ups. The faster I rank up, the quicker I'm going to be able to actually utilize the drills. Token merchant to a thousand done. Reach pet cax level thirty done and forty thousand blocks, which I can actually do very easily. Before that, let me redeem this skill point to get a one percent gem boost and start placing drills down again. Drills are 
absolutely by far going to be my favorite thing ever. Oh, that was a new mine rank. Okay, well, I don't want to waste any more drills because if I use a drill, no matter what, as soon as I rank up, it's going to just instantly waste that drill because after we rank up and get to a new tier where we get a pouch, we need to rank up one more time because as soon as we do, it'll reset our mine for a second time. Not really sure why, but that's just how it's always worked. And you know what? I'm going to go ahead and use these last seven, but I'm going to save this stack for now maybe i'll see how close i get to this challenge after this actually i could make it if i actually kept going but what i actually want to do is i want to try using a vintage plasma torch i've used these before they're decent but i don't know how they are at the start of a season i have a better idea of how to do this once i get it reset does it go all the way to the top almost all the way to the top i'm kind of flying in ranks guys i'm unstoppable look at this oh my god these things are insane i think i found the best way to start the season guys these this this all of this literally all of this this right here oh my god like anytime if i if i feel like i need to make some progress i might just utilize these that way i don't have to use them every time during stream oh well we hit 100 guys our first ornament point oh man i'm thinking a token boost i want more tokens I think this is going to be my rank up solver, especially once we get nuke and stuff going, like that's also going to be insane. Well, we hit our goal 100. Can I hit it 60 my pickaxe real fast before before we head out? Oh my god, wait, could I? Oh, Bane Miner activated. That's actually pretty huge. Gives us some uh, some tokens and gems. One more pickaxe level 260, and I also need like a few more blocks on this. So I guess I'm going to hit the, the level before I get the pouches open, which is perfectly fine. 120 on our mine, or well, almost 120 on our mine uh, about to be 60 on our pickaxe that is a pretty solid start three million prestige and about to be fifteen thousand blocks i am super excited about that oh i just realized i hit level 60 oh haha -ha. let's see so that unlocks lucky for me now lucky's a good enchant it gives tokens keys miscellaneous very good highly love it or highly recommend it definitely love it However, I'm going to go ahead and finish off, not finish off, I was close to finishing off Token Merchant. I think this is where I'm going to go ahead and end this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you didn't, you haven't yet, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe for more, and join the server. All the information is down in the description. I hope you guys, I hope to see you guys online for the brand new season of Akuma MC Prisons.